Fletcher on Tana Island. Oh, wow. Mount Yasa is a 361 metre high active volcano that spews clouds of volcanic ash and lava into the air every few minutes. It has been erupting almost continuously for centuries, and it is said that the glow from the volcano is what attracted Captain James Cook, the first European to Tana in 1774. Despite being active, Mount Yasa can usually be safely approached. I knew I would be able to get pretty close to Mount Yasa, but that I would probably have to share it with a few other tourists. Dusk is the best time to visit, as that is when he puts on his best show, and I couldn't wait to get a front row seat. on town has been dominated by nature, dominated by nature, magical things and spiritual things. I think the way spirituality is in Tana is you're aware of your life and right now standing a few metres away from a volcano I'm very well aware that I'm alive. Lots of the people here just seem to know they've got something special on Tana. They just have organic fruit and vegetables and a massive tree and a massive volcano because this is something special, even if I am completely covered in volcanic ash in my ears, in my eyes, everywhere. I think I can get over that for a while while I enjoy the volcano.